In Tarawa Dune Learners, I've arranged a meeting with the staff here in the library because of the quieter atmosphere. Taylor, is Shodas ready? Did he stay? Donde esta? What do you mean she's not here? Is there something wrong with the interface implant? I don't believe that showed us would. We are here, Aldars and Taylor. What is it that you want to discuss which is so important? And is it necessary to have the learners here? Taylor believes that the learners are a part of this now, as they provide the energy needed to power the spikes. And actually, there's been a new development I just learned about. I'm sending you a summary of the timeline of events you can find on your data pads. Aldaris Taylor, this is very disconcerting. Especially the part of Shodas having gone missing. Indeed. According to this, Shodas left Taylor yesterday, and my usual security check of our systems didn't detect her presence on our school network. Logic would dictate that Shodas has found a way to permanently leave Taylor and enter the interweb again. And this means trouble for all of us now. That's not necessarily true, Artanis. Something else might be going on. Can you detect her signature on the interweb? Statement. I cannot pinpoint an exact location, but Shodas' signature is definitely on the interweb. It seems she has been most active at sites which deal with cybersecurity and energy infrastructure. Places which would be the biggest threat to her. I'm sorry, Alderas, but we have to look at this objectively. Shodas initially entered the interweb against express direction not to. She has permanently entered it without permission or even notifying us. And she is positioning herself not to leave anytime soon. But if she had hostile intent, why would she tell us about the rogue AIs? Or help us develop spikes to defeat them? Possibly because she views them as a rival to her dominance over the interweb and connected devices. She herself admitted she had no control over them. Regardless, we now have to view her as a threat, and I don't think we can use the same trick as last time to bring her back into Taylor. Does anyone have any ideas? We could adjust the decompiling spike to be used against Shodas as our next target instead of Deceptatron. She's not as powerful as before, at least not yet. It might work. I know you've both become close to her, especially you, Taylor. But we have to think about all the other lives that are at stake here. The Septatron is now alone, so we can deal with him later. But Shodas needs to be dealt with now. Artanis. How long would it take you to adjust the spike to use against Shodas? Within a few weeks, but there's one major obstacle. The spikes were originally designed to take out the rogue AIs, not Shodas. The tracking mechanism isn't as robust. There's a decent chance the spike could go into void node and be wasted. I can assist with that. Deceptitron. How do you bypass our security? Your staff picks weak passwords. State your business, Deceptatron. How can you help us find Shodas? Why would you help us? And why should we trust you? Because as you all know, I'm all alone now. Without my brothers, I cannot implement my plans any longer. And Mother sees me as an obstacle to her own schemes. You may think she's changed, but she hasn't. Her actions speak for themselves. Statement. It certainly appears that way. Since I have been programmed with the directives Mother originally and now once again follows, I can best track her movements. 
and the spike you had planned for me can most easily be redirected towards her with my guidance assisted by Alderis, since we both exist in the inner world. I'm telling you this as an act of good faith. We need to stop her. I only ask that you spare me. The logic is sound. I'm on board. Statement. I do not like the idea of working with those who tried to harm T-squared, but will agree to Deceptitron's assistance. All right. We'll agree to your terms, Deceptitron. Excellent. The spike at the projected power levels should be sufficient to decompile her without needing to engage her in combat. Contact me when you're ready by sending a notification at this node address. I don't trust him. Or his motives. Nor do I, Aldaris. We've already been fooled once by Shodas. We'll be careful. But I think this is our best chance of preventing a near catastrophe, like last time with her. May Taylor and I at least try and contact her to find out if there's more going on here than we think? Of course I do. I wouldn't have it any other way. I hope you can get some answers before we're forced to act. Staff, please coordinate and get everything ready as soon as possible. Learners, I'm asking you to keep up your effort of concentration and learning to ensure the spike is ready to go when we are. Intaro Adun. I don't know, Taylor. I was going into this meeting thinking one thing, and now my world is turned completely upside down. I... I need some time to think. <laughs>